So small wall there, small wall up here and here. So basically move this over there and this could be put down here and there. We could gain, gain a lot of ground here very easily. And we could actually even put the wall down there. And I don't know how this, this is going to turn out. Uh, we don't really, really need the space on that side yet. I need to add a... And I, I'm adding a huge ton of pollution there at the moment, so that's going to be interesting. That sound was my inventory being utterly full. There we go. Now that wall is gone. I want to build these walls uh, first before I... Before I make the huge pollution up north from the oil fields and everything. Want to have the defenses in place. This is concrete, it increases uh, running speed by 40%. Not ne very necessary, but I like it. I like how it makes, a very, makes the walls very visible in the terrain. So this is done, there's a wall there. Uh, we need to move. No, that, that, that wall is in the right place. But I, I think I'm gonna clear out those nests. Because my huge pollution will be here. And here. So we're gonna go on an alien hunt up here. And make a wall up there as well. So let's, uh, let's head uh, to the oil fields now. Uh, get the train on the way. Choo-choo! Actually, on this train we should have... Remove that. Get the oiling ton. Go. Now it's driving itself to the oiling ton station. And I'm gonna stop it there. Uh, it seems there is quite dark in this area. So these do run out of power during the night time. I think? No? No, they actually are not. This is enough power for this in here. It's been a... Uh, no, actually the factories are not running, so... I don't know. And the pumps are not running, so I don't know either. Uh, what we do need here is... A couple of those. Uh, five is enough. No. Don't need ten. These are uh, storage tanks for the oil. Let's get one more. So while while they're drilling, they can just store that there. Also, if uh, the train is uh, full for some reason, like these are all, uh, at the moment full. We can stockpile the extra oil in there for now. Especially while I'm working on clearing out aliens and stuff. Uh, let's do a save here. And we might have to continue this tomorrow, but... We'll end the stream by killing some more aliens. Clearing out the neighborhood. That nest looks utterly terrifying. Why is there a bunch of islands wandering around? I think they want to make a new nest here.
those hurt. Oh, great. Let's anger everything in the neighborhood, because that's probably a good idea. Sweep. That amount of speeders is really utterly terrifying. If I run too close, they, they will insta kill me. No, not anymore. I think uh, we need, really should uh, think about making that better armor for combat purposes. There's really not. There's still a shit ton of worms. Sounds safe. I don't know how to deal with those huge nests. I don't think I have the firepower. Rockets maybe? Grenades? What is the grenade range by the way? I don't have explosion. Uh, coal. I think we can manage bit of coal. More oil. Nice. Let's see. Fuck it. <laughs> I have a drill on me. That's very low range. Does this even do damage? No. Mm -hmm. Kirjan <laughs> I wonder if the rocket launcher would help. Better armor would may also help, so I could do a dive in more safely. I think we just need to lo slowly whittle them down. Poison globe the big nests and then kill a wave of the aliens, run in, kill a bit more. Yeah. There we go.
That's not on, that's not the nest I was going to kill. Let's see what else is in there. Is that a, I'm gonna wait for the night, uh, daytime anyways. I'm not gonna suicide. These be ne nest sizes are starting to get a bit of out of control. I don't need know if I have enough ammunition for this. Let's try this nest first. Can you die? Let's go in with poison. Yeah, this seems to work much better. More aliens, less. <sighs> and then, then it's this insanely insane. No, well, it's not even insanely. I've seen much bigger nests. I mean, there is there is bigger nests there and there, but this is kind of kind of big. I didn't even destroy that one. And I got all the aliens on me. One side is down. Well, not one side. One, one nest is down. When you have a massive cluster of uh, those uh, aliens uh, or the nests, uh, they just spawn so many so quickly. Because you're just uh, in an endless swamp with infinite aliens. Drive by shooting. Got you. Let's get those worms in there. Ow. My armor needs uh, time to regenerate. Whoa, ho, ho. that's starting to be too many. I'm an alien wrangler. I need, I need to kill this ball now. I guess uh, having those turrets up and walls would help. Did I make any of the threats? I do not have enough ammunition for the turrets, though. But this is a uh, getting into small enough chunk to actually kill now. Plus 
plus there is no longer worms, which makes this so much easier. Well, yeah, one worm. And one more nest. There we go. It's really just patience and slowly clearing out what you can. I think we can handle a bigger nest as well. Uh, not with this amount of ammunition and what we have, but I'm sure we could do a couple of those bigger ones as well. Especially if I craft the mm, better armor, better armor for myself. Let's go with some material from the train now. For more walls. Thank you. Um, let's put those in there. There we go. It's fine. <laughs> Not exactly the prettiest uh, ever build, but it's fine. So we have wall going here, 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 and all the way there now. So we should uh, make a wall there as well. Also check out whatever is up there. Because uh, pollution will go over the river and it's gonna anger these really quickly into this wall, so we should clear out a couple of the nests uh, on that side of the lake. It's probably gonna... <laughs> Scrolling like that screw probably will screw up the stream uh, quality for a second really badly. We should actually build a gate here. We still have the gate materials, yeah. Triple gate would be nice. Yeah. Wooden just full of wood. That's my gate. Let's go check this area now. 
Should I uh, pick uh, some concrete as well? I want to nest here, please. That was a horrible idea. First down. So many worms. Whoa! Not even close. Barely felt. Ouch. <gasps> I need fish. Could you just extinct all the aliens? Uh, well, they keep spawning. They, uh, I mean, you get more and more nests uh, the further out you go. I don't, I don't think there is a limit to the map. But you, you can definitely do it in your local area. Just kill everything. Uh, that's basically what I have done uh, around my base. Just killed all the aliens that spawned there. So I don't need to worry about those. I'm really worried about my ammunition though. Have uh, killed uh, that nest as well. No. Oh. Few drills is not gonna spread that much pollution, right? <laughs> it might. Has to be night time. Makes it impossible to do anything. Can I make those goggles? Night vision goggles. Let's see if they are any any better than they used to be. Well, they do take shit ton of space from your armor, so no, thank you. I think there should now be no worms or very little for worms. Try a couple of these capsules. I've never actually really used these, especially in the newer version. Some of the stuff seems to be much better uh, in the new version. Ah, there is still, there is still worms. If I go from this angle, I can pretty much 
Strike on those. We do have save, by the way. Don't wanna walk. We don't wanna die. All three nests are already an improvement. So distractor drones are like that. I think they got all destroyed. Yeah. I don't think these uh, these are worth using. What was this? This where the defender capsules or something. Holy moly. <laughs> That's an instant death. <laughs> oh thanks rockets. Great sp spawning time. Just a couple, okay, ten worms will shoot through my armor instantly. They actually hit those uh, drones that are flying around me when I did that. They're the distractor drones, I think. I think they protect you from damage. Still seeing an elephant nest there. There we go. We did have enough ammo to kill kill them after all. And all the alien signs. No, 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 no. We actually have uh, over a 400, almost 500 of these now. Nice. That's gonna be good for my research. Even though I've almost researched everything already. Hmm. Let's get out, clear out that and guess that as well. Is it in, in the forest? It's in the middle of the forest. Great. <sighs> Stupid forest. Die. Actually, going, going from down here is probably a better idea. I see that uh, it's quite a lot of worms. I think there's like one nest in there, and just re rest is worms, yeah. <laughs> Ugh. Well, that's the nest. I do want the worms out as well. No, still the uh, same map. I I'm just uh, clearing up here in, in the north. Making some uh, neighborhood safety. My base is uh, having a just utterly bad oil issues and uh, <laughs> the Operation Oil became a uh, Tiny bit quick, uh, bigger than I intended originally. Because we found uh, more uh, oil than I expected. We are fighting then. Bringing freedom to the worms, yes. Well, aliens. In general. I actually need to set up a wall down there. 
get rid of this. Crew. <laughs> Pretty much. Peach lover. Let's put down some uh, turrets down here. Hey Sandam. Is this their planet? Yeah, it's their planet. We are uh, we are the colonizing bastards. Just got back from seeing Martian, it was so good, just like the book. Nice, nice Chuck. I really wanna go see the movie as well. And it's good to hear it's uh, actually a good movie. Mm, let's go pick up some uh, material from the train. Colonization? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, originally you uh, crashed to the planet because uh, the alien shoot down your ship. And uh, you're pretty much the only survivor and you need to prepare the planet uh, so that the rest of your uh, force can land here. Which means this uh, rocket defense. Which we actually we can build now. So... How they change this? Steel, concrete, pipes, processing units and electrical engines. The rocket silo is so much easier to do now. It's no longer a... Uh, utter bullshit. <laughs> Sun never sits in Bell's Empire. Yeah, uh, that's actually so much easier to do now. It doesn't require the... 7 trillion billion... Uh, Uh, what are they called? Thing is, those things. Uh, the modules. They no longer re require those modules, so they changed that for the better. It used to be utter nonsense how much you need to make those. They, they don't seem like a talking type. Let's clear out this, this herd. You wanna see my new wall down here, aliens? Come check out this. Holy shit, those turrets do some magic. Hey, come come check this this. Oh, whoa. They just want hugs. I don't believe. But these uh turrets do some magic on those aliens. If you could understand them, they would probably only want to trade Pokemon cards. Well, then I need to get even better shotgun shells. Go to the wall again. Wall magic, go.
Turrets are efficient, I have to say. It takes so much more time for me to kill an army like that. And turrets are like bang banging everything dead. Ah, crap. <laughs> My oil greedy eyes see something nice in the northwest there. Let's go take a look. Is that a massive cluster of oil up there? I see. I heard you have oil here. Ow. And death, it seems. Yeah, that's a... Uh, seven oil wells in, in a nice cluster. Bring freedom to their nation, I think I just did. But, 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 we may have to rethink our plans again. Uh, let's just get these, uh, the 15 oils in here, from here, and then tomorrow, uh, expand, expand, expand. Holy moly. That's all the worms. Oh, that's also dead. Rip Oilington? No, Oilington will uh, will be running. Rip me. No, but we'll, we'll save. Uh, we'll do Oilington, and then we need a, we need more oil. Of course. I'm worried uh, my metal production has died while I'm running around here as well. All the mining minefields are dead. Try not though. Yeah, I think that's enough alien killing for now. We pretty nicely cleared out this area for a future expansion as well. Need to just uh, destroy those and we'll move the fence up there, here, here, or something, something like that. Diseased blankets? I think this is my diseased blankets. These poison cloves. I keep throwing into the forests and to the alien nests and just kill everything with with these. These are really good good for clearing forests as you can see. I think that's my diseased blankets. I said I was gonna stop an hour ago, but I should stop now. <laughs> but oil and aliens and lack of sleep. It, would, it wouldn't be me if I had good sleep. This is one of those games, you can say goodbye to your sleep once you start playing this game. Wall is marked. Let's go uh, concrete the other walls as well. This should be easier to do. Just 
gun. I actually have guns on this uh, this wall here, but I don't have uh, bullets to give them. So, good luck, turrets. You'll be fine. So, uh, all the walls are done. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna go and grab my train next. And I'm gonna go back to my base, and we're gonna save there. Uh, we need these. Thank you. And we can grab those as well. Put that in there. We need to empty this train. Uh, actually. Which means... Concrete the world. This apparently helps with the pollution as well. Strange enough. concrete did I bring here? Well, now the outpost looks like an outpost as well. And this is one of those uh, outposts that will be permanent anyways. Because the oil will never fully run out. It's always going to produce at least a bit. So we might as well concrete that. Okay. Uh, we should leave these barrels here. You should have barrels. We actually have, have like a production here already, so I could actually feed uh, feed my drain. So I'm gonna do empty ones. Are gonna empty from there. And enter there. And these are gonna come down here. I'm um, gonna do it this way. These are damage. Should we put a flag on it and freedom? It's officially declared. <laughs> we should uh, use the concrete to write down freedom there. finish the other one because there is those wall pieces. Otherwise it's gonna empty all the wall pieces uh, on the railway, which I don't really want.
So, what will you name our newly liberated glorious nation? Uh, this was actually named already by Barbarics. It's called uh, Oilington. I think that's a fitting name. <laughs> Maybe the next one will be big oil. I'm a bit missing them as well, uh, Martin. PP Fellas Federal. Hmm. That might be a good name as well. Actually, so this this end is actually now fully uh, fully running. Uh, it just needs uh, battles, um, which I can give them. Make those. I'm gonna actually uh, save this. I'm gonna run to the toilet quickly, I'll be back in a second. We'll finish uh, this uh, before I end for, for the day. So one moment. And I'm back. Sorry about that. What will you do with our new freedom oil? Uh, plastics. Plastics is why I need more oil. this a bit because barbarics would uh, cry at me if I don't Hey, lazy. Uh, 
There we go. Sweet, sweet oil being shipped into the train. More laser threat damage. Let's get actually rocket damage. I might want to try one of those rocket launchers and see if they are any good. Not doing that much pollution. Actually, well, I'm, I don't know. While I'm working on these battles, I should go place down more pumps up in the north. I don't have the pumps on me, so. But we, we can actually. Uh, can do the pipeline. Meanwhile. We'll finish it off later on. <laughs> There's uh, this oil up here we need to get. Also, this train doesn't have uh, free fueling yet. So we're gonna just... Uh, Put them in the other one. Splitter for what? Ah, for that. So it puts them on both lanes. Because the arm puts them on the other side always. So it fills the whole line better. <laughs> Not enough oil. Nice. Actually, uh, this can be all the way there. Doesn't affect these these ones. These shouldn't uh, stockpile too much. Mm, actually, the last ones. This can this can take more. Where's my rock damage? Actually, let's take the lasers out of there so we don't have those waiting. So, drop those. Okay, now we can choo choo. Through the forest here, since my webcam. Some issues on the right side there. There's some oil there as well. Just one, but it's oil. Don't. Uh, what's my rail pattern here? Uh, we want to go through, just through that. Isn't Red Hand easier than just a uh, chest and blue? I want to have a like a buffer box there. That's why I have that there. It's a uh, buffering into the box uh, when the train is not there, or if there is too much stuff.
Let's go. Now we have rail signals. So nothing should crash into my train. Wait for a train crash. Nope. See? Works perfectly. And once I clear out, it will also go away. If I move this train out of the way now. There. Now it moves again. I don't know where I want this train though. Do I want this to the, go to the same oil processing? No, I don't. Oh, this needs uh, its own own mess. tunnel. Hmm. It's not gonna really match to the railway. <laughs> hmm. So we make some silly corner in here. Oil processing three. Uh, should that should be longer? There was a pylon in this forest here, but I guess not. Uh, I think tomorrow's project will be redoing my oil. Uh, processing a uh, train stations. Uh, Riley Lake. Shit. One moment. I forgot to rename it again. Uh, yeah, I can in a moment. I'm gonna run, run to my base and do this. Uh, 
I'll just park this train uh, where it should be. Not gonna finish the oil processing field uh, today. Up, not there. Choo choo. Now it's a uh, hands off driving. Yeah, that's much better now. Maybe a bit too long now. Oh, we stop there. One, one is coming here, one is going there, and one is going there. I think we need to make like a better looking, better looking mess. Time, I'm home. Uh, all time power usage. Oh, well, I can do 50 hours. That's a bit too long. Nice drop there. Hello drones. It's good to be home. The bot snakes have found you. <laughs> yeah, they have. They are, they are bringing ammunition and all, all the all the stuff. Well, they're bringing all of this. Mm, let's take a look. That's doing fine. That's doing fine. Fine, fine. Oh, yep. So, what, what are you doing? Um, these were causing some issues, but no, they, yeah, they are fine. Okay, I'm uh, gonna stop here for the day. Uh, it's been nice, nice eight hours of Factorio again. It's two in the morning. I need to wake up early tomorrow. Uh, we'll do some more uh, Factorio tomorrow, uh, the usual time, six p.m. Eastern European time zone, and we'll try to sort out this mess a bit more. We'll start probably by redoing the oil field totally. And then getting more oil from there, I guess. But anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow, so have a nice night.